Okay, um, I got a new bag the other day, and so I wanted to do, um, the what's in my bag tag. Uh, just real quick. Let's sit this a little farther. It's a really nice book bag. I got it from Barnes & Noble. I'm super in love with it. And it holds all my junk, um, actually more than is in it right now, so that makes me happy because uh, I really needed a new bag. The zipper on my uh, old backpack broke. So uh, anyway, without further ado, first of course is um, my planner and its little pouch. I've done a tour of my planner before, so I'm going to make this brief, you know. I got all of the stuff I would need in a pencil pouch in here. I'm going to do a quick dump out real quick down there. Oh, I found these the other day. Uh, let me see if I can get that to zoom in real quick. No? Can't get it to focus. These are uh, some sticky notes I bought a while back, and I think they're super adorable. Um, they have chalk pens and stuff because they can write on the cover and stuff and just wipe off. Well, if I had an actual something to wipe them off with. They can write on the cover and they can also write on uh, these little tabs in here. And then um, I also have my uh, oh, I have my handicap placard in here because that's where I keep it so I don't lose it. Um, I have whiteout and I have tape in here too. And I have all these washi tapes. I have regular scotch tape. Because you never know when you're going to need that. And I have all these pins. I have a glue stick. You know. Because you never know when you're going to need those things. And that's it for my happy planner stuff. Um, I have another pencil bag in here. Which, first off, I have this cool uh, little fire stone little firestone keychain on. It looks like Thor's hammer. Uh, not like in the movie, I mean, but like mythologically wise. It looks like those little uh, necklaces that some pagans wear, which is why I really like this keychain. But it's actually a firestone advertisement. My dad works for firestone. So, uh, because otherwise this wouldn't have a zipper pull. I don't know what happened to the original zipper. But I'm actually using this pencil case more of it like a purse uh, insert type thing. And then inside here I just have some of the basics, you know. Uh, solution for my contacts. Um, feminine products. Uh, my reading glasses. A protein bar, which is kind of squished but still edible. It, like if I ever really really needed it but it's kind of just an emergency thing because it looks gross now eye drops um, dry mouth gum and chapstick and that I put it all in here so it doesn't just get lost in the bottom of my bag because like I said it is a book bag it doesn't really have like a lot of pockets in it. It does have a couple of pockets, like more than my last one, but it it doesn't have a whole lot of like inside pockets. Um, in the back zipper part in here, I have my wallet, which uh, I'll open up real quick here because uh, it's not really a wallet. It's more like a coin purse type thing. But uh, I got a wallet insert for it so that I have. I'm not going to turn them over because this is my actual, like, credit cards and stuff. But I got a wallet insert for it so uh, that I could carry that stuff easier. And then I've got, um, I think, 
15 bucks and some quarters. And then I've got pink Batman and my cross keychain. And then in here I have just a little digital camera I carry around in case I want to take some videos or something. So I don't always have to lug my big camera around. Then down in the bottom I have um, my Kiwana pin which I was just prescribed which uh, finally because I've, I really do need something for breakthrough anxiety and I'm just taking it like half a bit every now and then to try and get used to it so that I can take it when I do have full blown panic attacks. Um, I also have a pair of what I call arm socks, but they're really just like arm warmers to cover up uh, my scars. And I have a deck of cards that I just got the other day. They're marble playing cards, never been shuffled. Uh, uh, just in case there's ever anyone to play a game with, I guess. But yeah, that's the back pocket. And uh, in the front here, I have Stitch on the front. I have Stitch on the front, and I got him when I was in Disney World when I was 10 years old. And I've had him ever since never lost him. He's been chewed on by a lot of dogs and stuff like that, but he's still holding strong. And then I got this when I was at the mall uh, last week. Uh, it's a cute little hand sanitizer thing, and it has um, rock candy smelling uh, hand sanitizer in it. So that's super cute. I'm crazy about like keeping my hands clean and stuff. So uh, I, it's nice to have one of those now because I've never had one of these before that holds hand sanitizer. I usually just carry hand sanitizer around. Then in here, uh, this is my other keychain, but I didn't want to put it on there because these cards are starting to tear off. Uh, but it's a keychain that has like little questions on it that you can just ask friends or family members. Uh, me and, uh, one of the little kids at church usually ask each other these questions, which is why I have it in there. I have um, a baby lips lip balm thing in here, colored lip balm. I don't know if it's considered a lipstick or a lip balm. It's pop of pink colored. And yeah, uh, it's in there just because these are moisturizing and they do give a little bit of color too. I have two more pens just in the front so they're easy access in case someone needs to borrow a pen. I have more gum. Um, I have uh, compression gloves for my hands. And I have uh, a little nail clipper kit, which is also where I keep my pocket knife. Because girls gotta have a pocket knife, right? Um, I also keep my inhaler in this part of my bag so it's easy access and I keep this, uh, I keep my little med case up here and it says give us this day our daily meds and it's got Jesus on it which I thought was kind of cute. Not so much cute as super hilarious and funny. So yeah. Uh, and inside of it, I've got, um, I don't know, I've got meds. I guess that's really none of y'all's business what I have in there. And I think that's everything in here. Uh, what I like about this bag is that the pockets on the side are actually big enough to hold a water bottle. And they aren't like, I don't know why some bags have like those fake, uh, pockets that are like big enough to hold like a pack of tissues or something but they look like water bottle pockets oh and I also have some earbuds um, but these are actually big enough to hold a water bottle which I think is nice uh, but obviously I don't want to always keep uh, water in there because that's kind of heavy and so right now they just 
are empty. I don't want to put a whole bunch of trash in there and like keep them trashed up. But here I have a spray right now. And you see, it's big enough to fit in there, which is big enough to fit in there, which I like about this bag. And this bag is big enough to actually fit like several uh, like books that are like full size, like as big as the planner type books. So I mean, it can fit a lot in it, but it doesn't have to. And I mean, it doesn't look that big. So that's what I like about it. And it's got really long uh, back straps to it, which is a lot of what I like because it's not like, with my other bags, they weren't, I think they were made to be carried by like smaller children. So like they didn't really have the um, straps on the back that were, uh, that fit me all that well. But this bag has like super long straps in the back. Um, so that I really like. And so, yeah, I'm just really excited about this bag. <laughs> I can't wait to carry it to church on uh, Sunday because uh, my other bag was always getting in the way and just super dumb. And this one I feel like I can hang on the back of my chair maybe or, you know, whatever. I feel like it's just, it's more grown up too because, I mean, it's a book bag and not like just uh, some little kid backpack. So, yeah. Anyway.